Hi, everybody. Welcome to Seattle, Washington. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Well, to almost steal a uh, bullpen analogy from baseball, there's a chance to bring in the closer here tonight. Yeah, you bet. Step over another hurdle, James. Get to the next series as fast as you can. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Quick pass to Nichuskin. Here's a short pass to Schwartz. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Breaker's own ability is what he digs at top speeds to create grade-A chances. Bjorkstrand's relied upon to generate chances for his team. I'm expecting one of these players to make a big difference for their team before the game is over. Back to you guys. And it takes a shot. Oh, steals a goal as he flashes a glove with a stop. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We're still scoreless. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. He was locked in there. Here he is in close. Oh, they do it again. He's like a backboard in there. Bang, bang, the puck's off him twice. He makes two stops. Quick pass to Larson. Seattle's got it in their own zone. The Avs scoop it up along the boards. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Drives to the sweet spot, and that one's broken up. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Seattle's got the puck in the corner, and that's poked away. Taken along the wall by Gord. And now it's grabbed by Schwartz. Back at the point, they set it up. Turns it aside with the club. Quick feed to Rodriguez. Great pressure to force the turnover. Launches it from the point. Comes up with the block. Moves it to Rodriguez. Oh my goodness, what a hit. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And that's broken up. And here's the pass to Nieto. Big hit along the board. Wow, did he finish him off there? Rick scores! Oh, that was a beauty! The man advantage break is sprung here, and they executed perfectly. Two different views from either side of me. One coach not happy they gave up the man advantage break. The other one's pretty pumped with how they executed it. Colorado's got the game's first goal here in the opening frame. Pretty tightly played game so far. Not a lot of chances, not a lot of errors on either team, but now we got one. Maybe the game will open up. Let's it fly. Oh, what a stop! Slides the puck over. Beautiful read in the defensive end by McCann. Colorado's got a hold of the puck now. Now he takes it over the line. Takes a shot. Tremendous read and even greater sacrifice on the block. A chance. Oh, he gets a piece of it with the glove. Moves it quickly over to Burakovsky. Oh, what a stop with the kick save. Gorgiev's able to make a save look really easy. Now he doesn't have to deal with the rebound either. No room for that one to get through. And that's deflected. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Now a quick pass to Nieto. Oh, look at this chance! To his teammate! And he makes the save. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Avs have taken a 1-0 lead. McKinnon's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Denies him on the one-timer. Oh, what reaction.
position. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. And that's turned aside by Grubauer. Colorado's got the puck. The Avs carrying it along the blue line. Pokes it away. Excellent hand-eye coordination. And the offensive onslaught will come to an end as the clock runs out, bringing the period to a close. As both teams get a breather, so will we. We'll take a quick pause for the cause. A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Ford's got it in the offensive zone. Can't connect. Over the line they come. Here's a chance. Oh, and there's a great save by Grubauer. Hammers went from the point. Oh, what a block. He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. Here's a shot. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Puck scooped up by Taves. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Grubauer. He scores! On the rebound, lights the lamp for the goal. He uses all the momentum of his stride to deliver that snapshot. It blows right by the goaltender. The Avs now have extended their lead to two in the second. They've been looking good here so far tonight. I've liked the way they've played, and while the game's a one-goal game, you still have to be pretty careful. Now they've got two. You can open it up a little bit, try and get a third one. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. You can sure tell when a player starts to press. Holds onto the puck just a little bit too long, tries a play that really isn't there. And now it's over to Gore. Seattle's in transition. The Avalanche have the puck against the boards. Trying to engage a little physicality here. And it's a quick pass to Comfer. The Avs move to the offensive zone. Oh, denies them with the paddle save. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Colorado's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. McCann's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Here's a chance. Whoa. There it is. They score. Johnny on the spot. He tucks in the rebound. You want money? You go to the bank. You want bread? You go to the store. You want goals? You get into the net. The rebound's there. He puts it away. Colorado's offense is rolling, and there's still a lot of time left. I don't think you ever try to not score. So you're up by a lot? Good. Score a few more goals. Carry this thing in. And things start to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Here's a short pass to Burakovsky. There's a hit on the play. The Avalanche have gained control of the puck along the wall. 
Seattle's looking to break out of their own end. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Takes it and looks ahead. Eller's already scored. That's his second! Their line has played really well, James. I like the way they've moved the puck. Finally, they're rewarded again. He's got them both. That's a good shot. He zips it by the goaltender, but he works himself into a clean area on the ice to shoot this from the high slot. The Avs continue to apply the pressure, and the offense continues to roll. This is like a steamroller now. It's like nothing will slow them down. Feeds it to McKinnon. Wrestling in close. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Grubauer's one of the group today for sure. It's not been very... Scores! Well, something to build on here. Yeah, you got to roll the climb still, but I guess you don't give up. You keep plowing away. Maybe you get one. Maybe you grab another quick one and get yourself back into this. Wow, did he hammer that? Too much power for the goalie to control, and it hits him and still goes in. The Kraken have gone back to center ice here in the second. They need much more of that. Yeah, they've been at center ice a lot, James, but the other guys have been scoring. <laughs> yes. Quick pass to Gerard from the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Oh, what a paddle save on the play! Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. I had a playoff run like this. When you score in the playoffs, you feel like you can score every night. Here in the later stages of this period, Seattle's been dominated to this point, trailing by three. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. His reflexes on display tonight. And he regains control of the puck. Seattle's got it in their own zone. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Receives the pass. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Turn that one aside. Sharp reaction save. Intercepted at center by Gerard. Colorado's blowing their opponent out of this game. They've intercepted so many passes, it's like they've played a perfect game. Grubauer's been sharp at various times. Here it's his reflexes that bail him out. A lot of velocity on that. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Colorado's won the faceoff. And the horn sounds to stop the bleeding, at least for a few minutes anyway. Don't go anywhere. Third period is just around the corner. The officials are set. The players are set. Ray Ferraro between the benches is set. I'm James Sabolski. Let's go. Third period underway here. This has been a total squash to this point. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Seattle's been a step slow almost all game. They haven't had the puck very much. They're losing. If that's going to change, they've got to get the puck and hold on to it much more. Colorado's looking to break out. McKinnon's carrying it ahead. Here's a chance. Denies him. The Abs will take it behind the net. Let's it go. That goes off a twig. Moves the puck. Great pressure on the offensive end by McKinnon. 
and tries to make a diagonal pass to Schwartz. Broken up by McCarr. The Avs have it now. Nice zone entry from the middle. Here he is showing in front. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Down the right side and into the zone. That goes off the mask. What do you think hurts more? He's got a headache or his jaw sore? That thing was a bullet. Still lots of time left in the period. Colorado's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. The Avs have it from their own end. Works it across to Comfort. They've got numbers. Slides it across. And that one's broken up. Skates across the blue line. Puts the puck on net. Club save and the play continues. Puck picked up by McCann. Scores! Now it's a two-goal game. Well, now they've got something to build on here. They feel now, I'm sure, like they're in the game because when you're down three, it seems forever away. Two parts to this, James. He gets himself into the low slot in good position, and then he zips a backhander past the tender. Seattle's still got to find two more goals, but they at least have one back. That gives them a little bit of hope, and the bench seems to have come alive a little bit. McCann's won the draw. Alexiak's got it along the wing. Quick shot! He scores! You're down by a couple. You want to give yourself the opportunity for a tie goal. They've done that with this one here. The goalie's not going to catch up to that, is he? That slapper went right past him. Close the gap here in the second half of this third. They've given themselves a, an opportunity now, just trailing by one. Taken by Manson. And no luck on that pass attempt. Quick feed to Everley. Puck sent over to Burakovsky. Moves it to Alexiak. Takes a shot off the mask, and he keeps it out. And now he moves it quickly to O'Connor. There he is from the slot, and that's broken up. Burakovsky's got it on the offensive end. Colorado's got the puck. And now it's grabbed by Rodriguez. Puck grabbed by Manson. Moves it quickly over to Rodriguez. Takes the pass. Stopped with ease. Picked up along the boards by Eller. Nearing the point. Let's it go! Denies him on the play. Puck scooped up by Schultz. And now he angles it across to Bjorkstrand. The Avs have it now. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Let's it fly. He scores! His first career playoff goal! He was saying to a couple guys this morning he thought he was going to be able to score soon. Looks like he's right. When the goaltender gets into the butterfly, he's just trying to take away as much of the net as he can. He's got lots covered, not enough as he gets beaten for a tally. In the final moments of this period, the Avs have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. McKinnon's one possession. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Keeps hold of the puck. Bjorkstrand's got it in the defensive end. Grabbed along the board by Gord. Seattle, Scully is on the bench. The extra attacker has jumped into the play. Colorado's got possession of the puck. Seattle's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Takes the feed at the point. Coming in. Scores!
about five years ago, they started to pull the goaltenders a little earlier. The coach makes a good call here. He gets his keeper out, and now they're able to punch through with their net empty. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Seattle's got the puck in their own end. Tanev's gaining momentum. Donskoy's got the puck. In desperate need of a goal here, they've got the extra attacker out. Here's a short pass to Donskoy. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a block stop by Georgiev. Ah, that's a good save there, James. It looks rather... Fires to the empty net. And there's the final horn, bringing this one officially to an end. Ray, game seven, buddy. Game sevens are the best. I mean, the, the do-or-die nature to it. Everything that you play for all year comes down to 60 minutes. I love it. And that'll do it from ringside, everyone. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Get home safely. Thanks so much for joining us.